Welcome to Dig Nation. Dignation.com. Bernie and <laughs> Give it a shot. How would you say that? Anastros. Anastros. I don't I don't know him because he's not from our district. He's on uh, Fox 5 K N Y W. Anastos. Uh, he's a weatherman. Uh, oh no, no, he's telling the weatherman. Well, I'll let you just watch the video. Okay, we'll yeah, because now I'm really excited. I haven't seen this. I know it's been around the internet, but I haven't. Uh, okay, apparently <clears throat> he makes, he, he makes just says random things all the time. So this is one of the things that he said. What? We can my glass. It's a tough man to make a tender forecast, Nick. Oh, yes, that's right. Keep fucking that chicken. Okay, I'll do it. What? Dude, so. Look at the eyes on the lady next to him. She's like. <laughs> He said, it takes a tough man to make a tender forecast. That's what yeah. he said. So then he said, keep fucking that chicken. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, wait, play that again. Oh, okay. It takes a tough man to make a tender forecast, Nick. Keep fucking that chicken. What? All right, before we continue, the lost symbol has found lots of readers. The new book by the author Wait, of yes. there must be an afterwards. No, 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 no. You know, basically, I mean, this guy is known for doing that. Like, he says fucking he, random things. Yeah, he's, but you can't curse on television. No, no, but I think he's got that kind of like, you know, where you just blurt out <laughs> random shit. Tourette's. <laughs> yeah, Tourette's. Oh, does he say, sorry, I said keep fucking that chicken, but... I don't think so. <laughs> Her facial expression is Let's see if... He's just like, he's like a real life Ron Burgundy, dude. Wow, that guy is a real life Ron Burgundy and my new hero. I know, how, I would tune into the news every night. If every I knew, night? If I knew he was going to say every some crazy night. shit like that. It takes a strong man to make a tender forecast. I guess that's it. Keep fucking that chicken, buddy. <laughs> you do your job well. Chicken fucker. <laughs> like, and what does that even mean? That's, that's the best that's part. That's what's so brilliant about it. That's the best part. I think it's because chicken tenders, right? Uh, I mean, I think that's where the logic, I mean, if there's any, comes look, in. Look how shocked. The, <laughs> oh my god, that is amazing! Uh, so oh good. my god, that is amazing. I think he might have been plucking the chicken. I think that's where his... Maybe. He oh, said really? fucking that the was... chicken. So. That is the best thing ever. Yeah, yeah. Glenn, just keep fucking that chicken, buddy. <laughs> you do what you do, my friend. In a chicken. That's... <laughs> like, what? Uh, this is where news needs to go. <laughs> I want my hard-hitting news, but I also want them to have a good time with it. You I want my I mean? soft-hitting chicken fucking news. That should be their new posters. Channel 5 new, News at 7. Keep fucking chicken, chicken. Chicken fucking good news. <laughs> <laughs> That's some chicken fucking good news. <laughs> <laughs> news that makes you feel like a man. Uh, Keep fucking that chicken. That's awesome. Amazing. I mean, and I love that he, the, the weather guy, was sort of like, oh, I will. <laughs> <Yeah>. I will. <laughs> will do, champ. Yeah, I know, totally. And the girl next to him was like, did he just say fucking a chicken on TV? It's so awesome. Where did my communication skills go? The eyes on that woman, though, are just, like, precious. Yeah. Gigantic. They were like saucers. Yeah, apparently he does this all the time. Crazy. Well, stuff. where's all the other videos, There's man? Other I want to see all of them. I, I can find one more. <laughs> Ernie Anastos. Uh, here we go. Here's Live him. news bloopers. Oh my god, I'm so excited. The Shea Stadium auction is up and running right now. And here's the story. The Mets fans are bidding up a storm. Everything from turnstiles to menu boards to store signs with pictures of the players. They're all up for grabs. Even the letters used to spell Shea Stadium are selling. The S is up uh, for 2500 bucks. If you want to log on to myfoxandwide.com, you can the dot. <laughs> <laughs> Like the scene on TV. Dot cock. <laughs> Amazing. Fox.cock. Fox, fox, fox. My foxnews.cock. If you want to log on to my fox and why dot cock, you can dot <laughs> com. Click the scene on TV tab for the link to the auction site. All right, Derek. We'll be right back. After uh, the break, wait. Uh, Very nice. How's the wake-up weather? It's going to be fantastic. we got a great forecast because you're going to have a big area of high pressures moving down, and that's going to guarantee not only a great wake-up, 
but also a great holiday weekend forecast. There it is. That high is moving in. Just a few high clouds overnight right now. But again, no issues in the forecast. Out the door in the morning, 58 degrees at 7 a.m., bright and sunny. And the sunshine will stay 74 in the high tomorrow afternoon. That's running uh, about 9 degrees above average. Now, 72 Saturday, 73 Sunday. Lots of sunshine. And a few clouds will appear Monday and Tuesday as we stay in the low 70s. Overnight lows in the mid-50s. And did you know you can go to myfoxny.com yes, and get that five day? That's exactly where to go. Time. And you get can it check all. out my weather blog there, too. You're a good man. Blog, right. blog. That's myfoxny.com. <laughs> Very good, Nick. That's our report for tonight. Thanks for watching and staying up with us. I'm Maria Nastas. I'm Barry Alexander. Thank you. All right. Wake up, of course, tomorrow morning. A good day in New York. 4.55 a.m. Have a good night. See you tomorrow. That wasn't as good as I wanted it to be after the break. Yeah. It was a little long. All right.